guys, so in today's video I'm going to show you the 100 equipment I bought online. So most of the equipment is very useful for people with hemiplegia um, and what I've found is that able-bodied people can use this equipment as well um, because you can prepare food in half the time that you normally would um, with other kitchen equipment. So this includes a multifunctional cutting board, a clip-on food strainer, a multifunctional vegetable chopper and an electric peeler. The multifunctional vegetable chopper is great. It has about five different functions. A fine dicer, a medium dicer, a spiralizing Gelini blade insert, a ribbon blade insert, and a spiralizer spiked grip. To use the dicers, you place slices of vegetables such as carrots, potatoes, onions, and peppers onto the dicer, lock it into place, and then push the lid down onto it. To use the spiralizer, you push a large chunk such as cucumber or courgette into one of the spiralizers and push down onto it with a spiked grip. I found this gadget quite easy and it felt like I could get the preparation process done faster than normal. The electric peeler was quite disappointing because you really need two hands to set it up. Once you have done that though and you've got the apple potato in place, you really just press a button to activate the electric peeler to peel the food you have chosen. As you can see though, it immediately starts working as soon as you plug it in, which can be quite dangerous. You also need to push against the vegetable to make sure it gets peeled evenly um, and cleaning it is very annoying. It's difficult to clean the little peeling attachment. I wouldn't recommend buying this. The clip on food strainer was excellent. I chose a pan which fits it and after boiling food, for example pasta, I clipped it onto the pan which was quite easy. You must remember to turn off the stove before doing this though so you don't burn yourself. Pouring off the water in the sink is really good as it holds the food fully in the pan. The multifunctional cutting board, as I've shown in previous videos, has spikes that you can put a potato or carrot on, for example, to peel them. Or if you need to butter bread, it can be held securely with a plastic clamp to hold it in place without any risk of it moving around. Thank you so much for watching guys, please subscribe and I'll see you in the next one.